The following paid commercial presentation for the Oster Kitchen Center Appliance is brought to you by Quantum Marketing International and Sunbeam Oster. There is no other culinary expert like this man. You've laughed at his zany humor, been swept up in his over 40 year love affair with food, and marveled at his amazing expertise. Graham Kerr's step-by-step -step approach to fine food has made success almost automatic for his millions of fans. Not only is Graham known for his trend-setting work on television, but he's also the author of 14 books with over 4 million sold. His latest work, Smart Cooking, introduces us to a new galloping gourmet. Graham has perfected an approach to cooking that is probably the greatest discovery of his entire career, his mini max cooking style. Intensive nutrition research combined with years of cooking experience have created fine, delicious foods with minimized health risks and maximum aroma, color, texture, and taste, our future food. Sunbeam Oster, a known and trusted leader in American kitchen products, is proud to present Graham Care, sharing his latest helpful creations with you. All the food prepared during this presentation will be with the help of an appliance that, like Graham's guidance, gives you a smart approach to preparing food. Convenience, ease, economy, space savings, and common sense have been combined to create the Oster Kitchen Center appliance, a six-in-one appliance that will perform just about any kitchen function needed for quick preparation of food. You're about to find out how you can make healthful breads, salads, sauces, desserts, sandwich spreads, even real ice cream, all with the same appliance. Sunbeam Oster presents Future Food with Graham Care and the Oster Kitchen Center Appliance. This is where I make my choices as far as future food is concerned. What am I going to feed my family? And future food is what this half hour is all about. The kind of food you want to select for the family that you love so much. All right. This is if you want someone to cook for you. This whole basket here is for all the food that I'm going to prepare in this next half an hour, except someone got to it first. All right. Now, all of this is quite obviously the way I'm going to use it, because I'm going to do this from scratch. And I took the two tabs and compared them with each other. There's a $9.60 difference. So I thought to myself, now, if that went, say, 26 or 27 times a year, I made that choice, you see, not to get it made for me, but to do it myself, I'd be able to afford this. Now, this is Oster. And what it is, it's really a nifty invention where you've got one motor only and you've got six nifty gadgets here which fit on to the one motor. And this is the point. I find that I buy stuff made for me when I'm short of time. You probably do the same sort of thing. Well, if you're short of time, it's kind of a hump. You say, oh, I can't do that. I've got to do this. I've got to, you know, buy something that somebody has done for me. Well, in this case, I say, eh, get these machines, put it on here, and let it do the labor for you, because it really does that. I'm going to show you how it is. Don't, don't think it's something you have to turn on. It'll turn you on. It truly will. Next half an hour, I'll prove it to you. OK? Oh, sir, come along to my kitchen, the one that I use on television, and we'll get together. All right, come on. And so, what's the object of the exercise? Well, better food. Mm -hmm. Marvellous experience. He's got your own stamp of individuality onto it. And, um, and some great recipes. Uh, by the way, uh, look, on the recipe situation here, I've got loads of them for you. Everything that I'm going to do today, don't need to make notes about that. With the Oster Kitchen Centre, you'll have this in with it. So look for it, OK? Little note from me to you. All right, now, um, this is a blender, and in the blender is a salad dressing. And I'm just going to wind that up to number 10, and we start to run it. And what I'd like to do is just say this one quick thing. We um, actually consume about that amount of vegetables per day, man, woman, and child. And we actually need to get this amount of vegetables into us each day. And there's a, there's a tremendous leap involved in that one. And this is where the Ocean Kitchen Centre helps you and I to be able to come up to that level. All right, let me show you how. First of all, it's the salad. And that takes 45 seconds, and it's a very simple thing some garlic cloves and some ginger, some fresh lime juice, and then to carry that kind of Asian sort of feel to it, some rice vinegar and just a little touch of light olive oil, okay? So that is whizzed up and it's all ready to be able to be used nice and fresh and full of life. All right, watch this. 
I love it. I've never been able to be so successful putting things together as this. This is the shredder and slicer. And so, if you want to get a load of vegetables quickly, what I think is a neat idea is making the ingredients as if you're making a salad at the same time that you're making a soup. And that really helps a great deal. So, whatever fits into the little uh, the feeder unit here, I put it on six and start to run it. And if you just simply rest your hands on it, <laughs> it does its own thing. Isn't that exciting? You've got a little plunger which goes down here, and you can use either this side of the plunger, if you just want to put one item in at a time, like that, or, and then you can use this side here to press it down. You see, it's infinitely variable in that way. Really neat idea. Okay, so just keep on feeding that into there. Now, here's the thing that some people say. They say to me this, Graham, if, just give me a knife and uh, I can do all of that and it's nonsense. Well, look, I'm, I'm pretty adept with a knife, okay? And there's no way that I can catch up with that. Even if I looked, there was no way that I could catch up. I could go on and I could, I could impress you with the speed of things, but it really wouldn't work. So with a little plunger there, push down, and let's have a look at these other things as well. I can put red peppers in there. I can put an onion in there. Um, and if you keep this out on display at the same time, you'll find that you'll use it and use it and use it. It won't be just a question of saying, well, you know, stick it in the uh, cupboard down here and it never gets used at all. This is going to turn you on to the idea of using more vegetables. That's my whole idea. All right, so that's nicely done. Um, over here, I've got a little bit of oil in the pan, and I've got just a clove of garlic and a little bit of ginger. So what I'm going to do with this is simply take half the vegetables, all right, that I did there, and mix them up so that you get a good range of them. Take half those hard vegetables, put them in there. That's going to saute for a moment to make the soup. And then here, I'm not going to waste a thing. Um, here, I'm just going to take that salad dressing that I made before, and pop that salad dressing, good time, take the lid off, place it on the top, whiz it all around so as to make sure that it marinates properly, and place that in the refrigerator. Right? If you like, you can leave it there overnight, it's not going to do any harm at all. And uh, in the morning, in the morning you can take it out and strain it off, you'll have that amount of the dressing and vegetable juices tingling to separate it. Here is what it looks like inside. And what I've done, I dressed some lettuce leaves, different kinds of lettuce leaves with this, and still had this amount left over afterwards. So it's really cutting back on the dressing. And then just pop that extra, it's crunchy and full of flavor and looks fabulous. This is a way of getting loads of vegetables to us. Whilst at the same time, having stirred this around over here, and got that fabulous aroma and everything coming up out of it. Then a little chicken stock poured onto the top. 15 minutes, slow simmer. Best soup you ever ate. So, salad and soup with just one run through the Oster Kitchen Centre. See how it works? And you can really get fresh vegetables into people that you love. All right, here are the numbers. And remember, it only costs about $1.50 for both of those things per head. Not bad, eh? Okay, so classic minestrone soup at 516 calories go down to 72. And the fat is 22 grams, and that goes down to only 2 grams. And then, as far as the cholesterol is concerned, just 7 milligrams of cholesterol with a classic, zero on Minimax. And for the salad, 560 calories and down to 149, and 55 grams of fat down to only nine grams of fat, that was the dressing, and zero cholesterol in both cases. I've got the most fantastic carrot cake. It's warm and spicy, and it's the most fantastic fun when you make it this way. You see, because you can actually use the whole thing as a kitchen center. All right, um, so first of all, we'll grate these particular carrots and uh, just whack them through. Yeah, look, and they, they form the perfect texture as carrots. You just lean forward like this and they're through. Not a question of skill, just a question of simply enjoying it. All right, so you just simply turn it off and just shake the carrots out. 
perfect texture, lovely and light, make a wonderful carrot cake. OK, well, we've dealt mainly with now speed, but how about skill? Because I know that's the other thing that can stop us from doing things. Well, here, not all beaters are created equal. Uh, they have different balances and everything else, and even if you get the right one and the right bowl for the right job, I, as a recipe writer and creator, would say to you, beat the egg yolks and the sugar together until they're creamy and ribbony. And you'll say, gosh, what is he talking about? And it's very hard to be able to give that kind of instruction. But on the other hand, you know, Oster people with this kitchen centre have put together some recipes which are really nifty. And in here, they tell you the number to dial up, in this case, eight, and the time to be able to run it, in this case, three. So you just press this down, get the beater nicely settled, and then start to run it. Now, this means that at number eight, it starts to move everything around, and by the time that three minutes is up, you look at that and you know that's what it should look like. So, you know, it's skill because it's giving you skill. In the same way, when you put all the dry ingredients into making up the carrot cake, then you incorporate it finally at number one until it just mixes together. Pour it into a loaf pan and make yourself a marvellous carrot cake. Now, Here's the thing, I make apple butter, spiced apple butter, instead of that goop that normally goes over the top. And I make it in the blender. So the blender comes together, like the centre as well. Then, <laughs> I told you it was fun. Then you can just whiz this on. It's a kind of small processor. Put that on to the top and run that. Now, I've got strained yoghurt and the spiced apple butter of the blender, which whizzes around in there. And in a moment or two, and that's literally as much as it takes, that's ready. And you can come over here, slice yourself a piece of cake, which has been made with the shredder and into the blender as well. And there, look at that beautiful shape and textures of the carrots coming through. Then all you have to do is just simply remove the <laughs> apple butter. That's it. Oh, look at you. Delicious. Ha! And just serve that over the top instead of the goop and you would be amazed at the numbers. All right, with a carrot cake with the marvellous topping that it normally has, 884 calories a slice goes down to 298, and 51 grams of fat goes down to just five grams of fat. Cholesterol from 305 milligrams per slice down to 36 milligrams. Those are pretty impressive numbers, aren't they? So, now is a chance for you to find out how you can get one of these things. But don't forget, immediately afterwards, I'm going to show you how to make the greatest burger you've had in a long time and ice cream. <laughs> yes, it's true. Here it comes. Meet the appliance that will bring future food to your table, the Oster Kitchen Center Appliance. A sophisticated design that's simple to use, the Oster Kitchen Center performs practically all your kitchen chores because it's actually six different high-quality appliances. The dough maker gives you the joy of making your own breads at home. Make your own whole wheat dough or muffin mix. The stand mixer comes complete with beaters as well as a four-quart and a one-and-a-half-quart glass mixing bowl. Use it for cake mixes, chocolate chip cookie dough, and fresh mashed potatoes. The dough maker and mixer, together with a 10-speed power base, give you a wide range of functions for folding, stirring, mixing, creaming, kneading, beating, and whipping. Remove the kitchen center's arm, and the base is now ready to power a 5-cup osterizer. Use the osterizer's power to make your own homemade peanut butter. Blend raw ingredients for all kinds of mixes. Create your own homemade coleslaw, and even make fresh breadcrumbs. Changing is simple. And you have a mini food processor. Create salsa in seconds, mince garlic, chop herbs like cilantro, make sandwich spreads, and chop nuts with very little effort. Without any tools, remove the food processor and add the next appliance, a salad maker. Look at how it shreds cheese for salads and pastas and slices vegetables for a garden salad. But the Oster Kitchen Center has still another easy-to-use tool, an ice cream maker. This is a real ice cream maker, and the designers at Oster have made it so simple you only need ice cubes and table salt. Right at home, without any mess, without preservatives, make your favorite flavors made from ingredients you select. 
Oster's specially designed opening permits you to add delicate additions like chocolate chips to this mint chocolate chip. Look at these results. This is homemade. The ice cream maker is normally not a part of the kitchen center, but because Oster wanted to put together a special package for viewers of this television presentation, they've added it to the center. In addition, you'll receive a smartly laid out, easy to read 148 page recipe book. And when you order from this television presentation, you'll also get the opportunity to receive a free issue of Eating Well magazine. All of Graham Kerr's future food recipes seen in this presentation, plus a letter from Graham welcoming you to the world of future food and the Oster Kitchen Center. You might expect to pay seven or $800 for the power and versatility you get with this American-made product. This entire package, complete with the ice cream maker, is now available to you for the special television price of three payments of only $89.95. To order an Oster Kitchen Center, just call the toll-free number on your screen. This six appliance in one center carries a one-year limited warranty in addition to a 30-day money-back guarantee. The money you'll save using fresh ingredients rather than prepackaged meals can pay for a kitchen center before too long. Call now. Make a smart choice as well as a long-term investment in a healthful future for your family and yourself. I think this is really where the kitchen centre should be, which is dead centre in your kitchen, up on the bench, with the food processor in place. And the reason for that is it, it'll turn you on to great ideas. For example, this one. Now, you can have, you know, hamburger. Just go and get hamburger from the store, but it's going to be very fatty. You can get very lean meat, like bottom round, and then whiz it up in this machine. I'm going to show you in just a moment. And it's wonderful, especially with the seasonings in it. Or you can go an extra stage and get chicken and get the skin off, and it looks just like that. So then you just cut it up, put it into the food processor, and just place on top of that a little seasoning. Now, here I've put just some crisp pieces of uh, onion and a couple of tablespoons full of parsley with the stalks on it as well. Fantastic. And here, some mustard, you know, the kind of stuff that you get from a Rolls Royce, that stuff. And just pop that on the top, and then just pop the top on there, it just fits in like a dream. Put your hand on the top and pulse it. Now, it is actually pulsed about 20 times. You can see it very clear. And when it's done just like that, it's done. It makes the most perfect burger, just as quick as light. And now, imagine that you can do this with beef and also um, if you wanted a totally vegetarian burger, you've never tried one, and you think, well, you know, maybe that would be good. It looks like this when it comes out, like this burger there. Beautiful. So, then you just simply um, put it into a little measure like that. This is the chicken one, of course. Press it down, and then all you have to do is bang it out like that, and press that on, and you've got yourself a chicken burger made, right? Ready to go. I mean, quick. And this is what it looks like. Now, the way that I serve it up nowadays, and I think it's rather fun, is you simply take your garden burger, which is what I've called this one, or the chicken one, which is this one, and you might have noticed that I have white bread under this and brown bread under that, whole wheat. So put a white top on that one, put a brown top on that one, you're 50% there. That, I mean, it's delicious food, and it's so incredible to be able to make things up like this just for yourself and your family. According to needs, you see, Dad wants hamburger, you want a chicken burger, and the kids, of course, are raving for a garden burger. All right, well, here's the numbers. And now for the chicken burger. Here, in the same comparison with the classic hamburger, 738 down to 349 in calories. Fat from 42 grams down to only 10, and cholesterol, 334 milligrams, down to 69. Now, this is a tremendous treat, really. Uh, for those people that like ice cream, this is going to be something else. Blender on the top, uh, and two cups of the frozen raspberries. Isn't that nice and noisy? go poof, into the top. And one cup of sugar. Make sure that frozen raspberries aren't the ones with loads of sugar in it. Huh? And then put the lid on the top and just whiz it around. It's um, just set up so that it's on about seven or eight, should do it. 
And as you see, it's just beginning to combine with the sugar there and will gradually incorporate the sugar all the way through. OK, whilst that's going on, here is the ice cream maker. We're going to do it with iced yogurt, actually, but ice cream is the idea. Now, I've got it almost filled up with crushed ice. And over the top of the crushed ice, just keep on in layers, at about four or five layers of salt. Just pour it around, ordinary kitchen salt, and then put another layer of ice on top. You might have noticed I got a bit of salt on the top of that plastic cap. Keep the plastic cap on, unless you like your uh, iced yogurt with salt in it as well. All right, place it around the outside. So you've got layers, all right, all the way up. Good. So with that finished, all you have to do then is just to remove the cap. You can do that now that the salt's all over. And this is all finished. Stop the blender. And then pour this fabulous, look at the color of it. And the sugar's had enough time to literally melt into the fruit. That's your base. And then non-fat yogurt. And even for those who say, eh, no, I don't, won't have it, you wait until this combines with the sugar and the raspberries. Phenomenal. And it's the soft way in which it's done. Beaters, just plunge them in. They find their own hole. And then a little clear cap that goes over the top. Another thing, isn't this easy? It's sort of designed for people like me. <laughs> and just place that on the top there. And it's got a little hook that comes around, just like that. And then you just pick it up. Pop it onto the top, same sort of fit as with all of them. And then dial four and then run it for 20 minutes. Now, you could walk around, you can do whatever you like. You, just, you don't have to go anywhere near it. It's perfect. So after that 20 minutes is over, which is this one, actually, at this very moment, it's had 20 minutes. So we stop that and lift the top off and look at it. Now. At this stage, you could actually scoop it right out of the container and just get on with it and serve it. I mean, if you're that anxious. Or you can put it away, and this is where you get that little plastic cap back up again. Bang it on the top and lift it right out. <laughs> um, this goes off into the deep freeze, and there you can store it. Or, as in this case, you can bring it out when it's frozen. Get a good scoop, ice cream scoop. Just whiz into that. The texture is great. Just scoop it out. And with a glass, a, a good looking glass like so, I think just one scoop should be enough. I'll give you the numbers in a moment. Put a little bit of mint on the side and maybe a couple of berries, or maybe three. <laughs> I love them. And that's it. Now, this makes the most fantastic dessert, especially when you see the numbers in just a moment. It has a great taste and a great texture, and all you did was walk away from it for 20 minutes. Oh. Now for the yogurt. OK. Um, compared with classic ice cream, 472 calories for a half a cup, and uh, that goes down to 236 calories. 34 grams of fat for the classic, down to 0.6 of a gram for the Minimax. And cholesterol uh, goes from 123 down to 2 milligrams. Coming right up is uh, a way to make a really delicious decision. See you in a moment. Meet the appliance that will bring future food to your table, the Oster Kitchen Center appliance. A sophisticated design that's simple to use, the Oster Kitchen Center performs practically all your kitchen chores because it's actually six different high-quality appliances. The dough maker gives you the joy of making your own breads at home. Make your own whole wheat dough or muffin mix. The stand mixer comes complete with beaters as well as a four-quart and a one-and-a-half-quart glass mixing bowl. Use it for cake mixes, chocolate chip cookie dough, and fresh mashed potatoes. The dough maker and mixer, together with a 10-speed power base, give you a wide range of functions for folding, stirring, mixing, creaming, kneading, beating, and whipping. Remove the kitchen center's arm, and the base is now ready to power a 5-cup osterizer. Use the osterizer's power to make your own homemade peanut butter. Blend raw ingredients for all kinds of mixes. Create your own homemade coleslaw, and even make fresh breadcrumbs. Changing is simple and you have a mini food processor. 
Create salsa in seconds, mince garlic, chop herbs like cilantro, make sandwich spreads, and chop nuts with very little effort. Without any tools, remove the food processor and add the next appliance, a salad maker. Look at how it shreds cheese for salads and pastas and slices vegetables for a garden salad. But the Oster Kitchen Center has still another easy to use tool, an ice cream maker. This is a real ice cream maker and the designers at Oster have made it so simple you only need ice cubes and table salt. Right at home, without any mess, without preservatives. Make your favorite flavors made from ingredients you select. Oster's specially designed opening permits you to add delicate additions like chocolate chips to this mint chocolate chip. Look at these results. This is homemade. The ice cream maker is normally not a part of the kitchen center. But because Oster wanted to put together a special package for viewers of this television presentation, they've added it to the center. In addition, you'll receive a smartly laid out, easy to read 148 page recipe book. And when you order from this television presentation, you'll also get the opportunity to receive a free issue of Eating Well magazine all of Graham Kerr's future food recipes seen in this presentation, plus a letter from Graham welcoming you to the world of future food and the Oster Kitchen Center. You might expect to pay seven or $800 for the power and versatility you get with this American-made product. This entire package, complete with the ice cream maker, is now available to you for the special television price of three payments of only $89.95. To order an Oster Kitchen Center, just call the toll-free number on your screen. This six appliance in one center carries a one-year limited warranty in addition to a 30-day money-back guarantee. The money you'll save using fresh ingredients rather than prepackaged meals can pay for a kitchen center before too long. Call now. Make a smart choice as well as a long-term investment in a healthful future for your family and yourself. Well, I wanted to take just one last moment and just have a word with you about why I'm doing this program. You see, basically, it's because this kind of food is so exciting. This is a tribal meeting place. This is where family and friends gather together for restoration, where we come to eat food which is going to be good for us and give us great food for great years, if you like. And you see, Oster had the same sort of fascination with this that I had how to minimize risks for you and how to maximize the flavor and the enjoyment of food for you. And so it, it's sort of how to please people and how to care for them at the same time. And they've really got a good machine. This is a wonderful machine for its money. It's fabulous and it really does help. And so I thought, well, if with their machine and with my kind of um, oh, joy at doing this sort of thing, we might be able to serve you better. So that's really the bottom line how to serve you with great food for great years. And uh, I'll drink to that with the alkalized wine. God bless. The preceding paid commercial presentation for the Oster Kitchen Center appliance was brought to you by Quanta Marketing International and Sunbeam Oster.